going to be a great event, too. Sure this is, is a great yeah. prize today. Well, earlier, Tim talked about the bustling housing market here in the area. It's a dream for many to become a homeowner, and the Housing Authority of Champaign County works to help make that a reality for everyone. David Northern Sr., Executive Director and Chief Executive Officer, joins us. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, everybody, I think, has heard of the Housing Authority. That's a familiar term to most, but I would venture a guess that most don't have much of an idea as to what you do yeah. there. So uh, recap that for us, if you would. Well, the Housing Authority is that, or that organization that provides affordable housing to the community. We provide affordable housing for low-income families, seniors, and people with disabilities. We receive our funding from the federal government, which allows us to operate here locally to provide that housing resource. Got it. And it says here in my notes, you've successfully received a moving to work designation, but I don't know what that means. Okay, so <laughs> moving to work is a special designation that the Department of Housing and Urban Development provided to only 39 housing authorities throughout the nation, so that's less than 1%. Wow. So that means we're pretty special. Yeah, we are. <laughs> Absolutely, that's so, nice. So we're allowed to utilize our funding in a block grant format to work locally to make programs to benefit our community. A lot of times the housing authorities have to follow a top-down approach from the Department of Federal and Government, but here they give us the flexibility to utilize the programs and the funding to make it work here in our community. So with that in mind, what's on your to-do list this week, for example? What are some <laughs> of the things that you're that you're doing with your day to, to make a difference in Champaign County? Well, one thing, I'm being here uh, on CI Living to make sure individuals understand our programs and things that we're due. Um, have a number of meetings set up to establish partnerships throughout the community to ensure that our clients that we serve have the utmost and support in terms of overcoming those obstacles. Having that move to work um, designation, we provide our clients, um, they have a term limit. So if they're non elderly and non-senior, they only have eight years to be on subsidized housing. And it's a work requirement. So they have to, if you're non-elderly and non-senior, and we call elderly 55 and up, you have to work or be in school if Got you're it. a head of household or an adult member of the household. Got it. So how can people, I guess, take advantage of what you do and, like, participate? Well, I mean, it, it's tough. It's challenging. You know, resources is not there. And that's why we have a lot of programs that we try to create opportunities to utilize less of a dependency on a federal dollar. But in order to be a part of our programs, you have to go to our website, which is hacc.net, uh, and you can look up and find um, um, our, our various websites for our um, 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 developments that we have, our waiting list. Set. You know, we have a number of developments throughout the county. We have partnerships with individuals throughout the county that provide housing. And so, be honest, though, it's uh, close to 900 people on that waiting list. 900? Wow. 900 people. So oh there's my. way more well, interest or need than there is availability. And when I say people, I mean here as a household. So that yeah. means it could be a, a household with five members of the household in there, but only one name is the head of that household. Oh, wow. You guys have a big event coming up yeah. here soon. 75 years yeah. as an organization? Yeah. You look yes. great, by the way. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's because he gave up meat. Exactly. I gave up <laughs> meat. Only, only Rough day to have meatheads in the house, isn't it? But yeah, you know, it's important to celebrate what we do as an organization organization. A lot of times, as you said before, people don't understand our organization or what we do. And so we want to celebrate with the community. One, we moved into a new facility, which is more uh, better equipped to serve our clients and for our, our um, uh, staff, right? So our staff is also our clients. We have to treat them well also. So we put them in a good environment so they can do their job effectively. Also, we have a community center um, next to our uh, building now, our new facility on Market Street. And so we're celebrating our 75th year anniversary. Housing Authority was created in 1943. It was created because of the 1937 um, Housing Act, and that 75th anniversary will coincide with our open house. So we're inviting the community in to celebrate our 75 years of um, um, great work that we've been able to do here in this community, along with allowing the community to see our new um, um, facility. Awesome. Yeah. yeah, I love that it's called a housing authority or ministry of housing, as you are yeah. ministering to <laughs> others exactly. and serving yeah. others. Yeah. That's fantastic. Thanks for being here, David. We appreciate yes. it. Yes. And we will connect you with all the details at our website. You can see their logo right there. And just go to ciliving.tv.